if your battery's going flat overnight, you need to check for a drain. We're going to show you two ways to do this. The first method is using a current clamp that reads DC amps. First, set the meter to DC amps and zero the meter. Simply clip the current clamp round all the cables on either side of the battery. It doesn't matter if you do it on the negative or the positive, as long as you do all the battery leads on one side. As you can see, there's a very low reading on this one, but the maximum we want to see is 0.2 of an amp. As an example, we've now opened the door on the car, and as you can see, we've got a drain of over 1.7 amps. We're now going to do the same test using a simple multimeter that will read current. It has to be used in series. So we need to move the leads to the 10 amp scale and set the dial to 10 amps DC. To carry out this test, we don't really want to disconnect the battery, otherwise central locking and such systems start operating. So using a crocodile clip onto the clamp and the probe through the center, we can ease the battery terminal up, thereby putting the meter in series to get a current reading. As you can see, we have a low reading. Again, we want it to be less than 0.2 of an amp. As an example, again, we've opened the door now, and as you can see, we're around 1.7. If you find you have a drain of more than 0.2, obviously you've got to find where it's from. Normal things are CD players, boot lights on, even heated seats, that sort of problem. The only real way is to disconnect the fuse to each item one at a time till you find the problem. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel.